are what do you call this place? <laughs> I can't pronounce it. And it were it's Friday morning we're down. <laughs> uh, anyway, I just I can't I can't pronounce the name of the watch too. Twenty minutes out of Holly had this uh, what these officers are. That's the best as I can tell you. Never go slow or hard like a rhino. Right, that's sure you can see us, so don't know what clips we got today, if any, it is now half past five. We are on our way from Mona to Conway for a client meeting and a staff meeting. Um, yeah, so that's the plan anyway. We might try and vlog in through the hotel with our meeting, but uh, we'll see how we get on. So we'll interview tomorrow, all day, up until whatever the end of the day and then we will I think we have it booked back to back hopefully find some damn good people so with all the usual issues to deal with with customers and clients and issues back at HQ and clients coming on board and new clients and where we terminate clients not doing the job right they want to be compliant clients that we have terminated over the last couple of months who are looking back on our schedule but we're that busy we can't get them on the schedule so that's the problem if we do end services or if the client wants to end services or we terminate services, it leaves us in a bad, well, it leaves it very difficult to get you back on the schedule. But well, we'll talk about that in another video. Right, let's go. Alrighty folks, good morning. We are, I can't pronounce it. And anyway, it's Friday morning, we're down here now um, doing interviews for posts in Mona in our transport hub, the Hollyhead Transport Hub. We have back-to-back -back interviews all day long. Um, we've just finished our first gay there, so I see the next man sitting in the lobby. So yeah, we'll try and document as best we can. Yeah. National TM. Mm -hmm. That's all the help here. Mm. Be nice I wouldn't be able to be your right, yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'll just I'll update the camera here. It's um six o'clock, Friday evening, back to back interviews all day long. Anybody who's watching our videos that was interviewed, thank you very much for attending the interview. Mark will be in touch with everybody. And if you're not successful this time, don't worry. We will ask you, can we keep your CV on file if you've been shortlisted? And um, as the next couple of months go on and we grow out our sites, well then we will be looking for you. So there's two more days coming up as well next week. There's two more days is right next week. Today is Friday, we have two this week, two more next week. It's draining, but we had some we had some damn good candidates. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Yeah. Some real good people in. Nearly all of them you would offer a post if we could. Yeah. Um, but it's just not that easy. So we'll see how next week pans out and then we'll we'll get back to them. So I don't know if they can see the offices that we have here in in Hollyhead. Sorry, not Hollyhead. I can't, I can't pronounce the name of the watch town. 20 minutes out of Hollyhead is uh, what these offices are. That's the best as I can tell you. Right, we need to have a couple of private conversations here and um, that is all. Right guys, time to get the hell out of here. Thank you. Never go see you soon. soon. Pits are good today, which is a good thing. You know, with the canal running in your yeah outside. All right, there's a separate test. 
Was this, do you know if this was an authorised test lane? Yeah, it was. It, it was wasn't yet, site, was yeah, it For the rider, yeah. Got them sorted because they, because they broke into the prop set, so uh, they're all, it's quicker to get them out that way. Yeah, well, usually the police don't like getting involved. <laughs> it's um, often parties already. Yeah, well, they're looking to strip out. And now we've had a couple of their investors approaching us. They use they use a reinvestment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They do. Well, what are you thinking? Slop. What's it all fence with it? The buses and then they say no with the other says there's, there's no room. So I told him kind of what our structure is. I says this subletting. And he says we have six businesses to, to sublet from ourselves. Alrighty folks, so back down Hollyhead here. I'm not sure if you in the last, one of the last clips we were in Birmingham viewing yet another new site uh, for possible acquisition over uh, the due, due diligence side of it to be due and then heads of terms and things but uh, exciting times down in round Birmingham again. So that's Liverpool, Hollyhead, Birmingham, Durham and Newcastle um, for those side of our business which is TLS Transport and Logistics Services Limited in conjunction with Hollyhead Transport Hub and then of course powered all by Benfrey Holdings. Yeah, down this morning here it's um, 6.55, having a quick briefing this morning, a um, quick briefing here with the guys before we head out on site so when they come down for a bit of breakfast we're in the usual wee spot that we stay in Mona. Hey boss. There you go. Keep it going, mate. Gentlemen, thank you, sir. Okay. So we will wait. Boys are getting a bit of toast, and then we will kick on. So, as we say, Birmingham, which is exciting news, watch the space. What we're doing there, and then we also have uh, today as we're running over to Hollyhead out on site. We have a number of new client meetings coming out on site and then we have another workshop on site to see in Hollyhead Port itself. And then after that, tomorrow's all day, back to bike interviews as well. Did he get sorted? That's what's done now. Um, where are we here now? Stafford Service is just off to drop one of our drivers off <clears throat> from our Hollyhead Transport Hub. Down here at Stafford, lifting a, a truck and trailer. Um, drivers out of time, so it was a driver rescue. Guy have come down, he's doing the driver's way to do his own thing. The vehicles have come back to Hollyhead. We're gonna drop the trailer in the port for him, bring the track unit back to Hollyhead Yard, and then they have their other driver. I think flying into Liverpool Airport. Our driver support's gonna lift him from the airport, bring him back up to lift the track unit tomorrow, and we'll probably save that company. But between diesel and downtime, um, thousand pound, two thousand pound maybe, especially on time. So yeah, we need to move on here because we need to get back up the road ourselves. So that's just a part of one of our services at Hollyhead Transport Hub. So for more information, follow us. Let's go. Stephen, did he get sorted? Um, just met the guys here from some of these washes. I think we're, uh, we have them ordered, ready for fitment in Hollyhead at our Hollyhead Transport Hub, possibly our new site in Birmingham. So we're dealing with a couple of them and they're a damn good job, you know? They're real good for drivers and all. You probably know what they are guys, the washing machine, tumble dryers. But yeah, good meeting with the guy. It seemed to be, it's the reliability we want more than anything else. We want the ease of access for drivers, for card payments let them bang away all night long, get their clothes washed, dried and put away. So um, yeah, that was worth calling in here, this guy. Good, good contact to have. Right, let's go. Saturday morning, um, 6.15 a.m. We're just heading over to one of our guys from another location. 
close by. No, 30 minutes away. And then we are up to our site in Mona to finish off with a sign for the official opening and meet two new clients. So join us. Sit there now for a second. It is absolutely freezing. It is the 10th of February, 2024. Right, as usual, GoPro bad light, so I'll touch base in a second. Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to this part of the vlog. Don't know where we are in the vlog, but um, yeah. Anyway, it is Saturday morning. We may have put something up earlier on this morning. It might have been on TikTok. So if you don't, follow us on TikTok, follow us on Instagram, follow us on Facebook, follow us on LinkedIn, and of course, follow us here on our YouTube channel at TCTS Group TV. Anyways, I am on my way back here now from a job near Liverpool back to our Hollyhead site. Um, the guys are just finalising things this weekend. As I say, the day is Saturday. And anyway, the guys have the whole yard read out because there's CCTV ducking and uh, wiring going in. There's electronic barrier sensors going in. And what else are they doing? Yeah, they're finishing up traffic management plans. So they've everything out of the yard. And I want to go around and see, call in my way back to the boat, make sure that they're up and going, everything's okay, and that they can get operational for Monday. So Monday, the 6th of February, 2024, that's our soft opening should we say the yard has been extremely busy since we started it um and especially for rescuing drivers um guys coming in as a trader swap yard we've had a number of bits of storage going on as well and uh, but we complement that in our birmingham site so it's been working out fantastic for operators it is a end-to-end -end business service here guys that's exactly what the site is but anyway i'm going to nip up the road here because i need to get back for the 2 p.m irish ferry sailing the rugby is on this weekend as well so we want to get looking at a bit of that as we're on the scene so yeah let's go and see what they've been at Alrighty, folks so we are back here at our hollyhead transport hub and just in doing final snagging we have eventually after waiting a period of time got the rest of the wash put in so we have the wash from back there graded out the whole way piped correctly we're putting in this extension on the wash for the likes of some of our livestock guys coming in to wash out yeah it seems to be torn out a good enough job seems good enough mark's been in with his crew from our facility side as well um checking all out so i'm just on site as well to meet a couple of new clients for jobs that have to run here today well as we said in the last clip with the interviews yesterday for the site so we can start to take our guys from the midlands and ireland take them off this site and let the guys local run it um it's looking good yeah we're happy enough we're happy enough, it's looking good. We might put a drive through wash in it, but I think for the likes of our livestock men and our specialist haulier guys in, um, just the extendable lances on the reels is going to be a far better job. Also, a bit of MOT prep washing can be done for maintenance facilities just next door here. MOTs, safety inspections, run repairs, all the usual. Right, I want to go and see the one of the new shower blocks is in, and I know Mark and his team have it all snagged out, and I want to go in just to see what way it turned out. So let's get a look at that. Righty, so with the share blocks on either side, we're going to take a look at this one here just to see have we all. So we've all brand new shower blocks <coughs> fitted. All changing areas. So all brand new here, guys, we've fitted into it. Okay, the likes of our heaters all fanned up, power shower all of our benches for guys getting changed and enough room very very important for us to understand especially as drivers ourselves you need that bit of room uh, to get changed we'll have it facing into an alleyway here behind us so the guys are protected from traffic vehicular movements and the wind and the weather also so everything's good the guys have, haven't mark and his team haven't fully signed off on it yet but everything's good everything's checked all good to go so right let's go in, into the office take a look at the separate toilet facilities so we'll have the shower facilities and what we wanted was separate toilet facilities as well so it's not all dueling up um so yeah the guys have this all snagged off it's got the first clean's got all the plastic taken off the guys are going down and clean it so again the toilet facilities we wanted standalone toilets away from the showers we want the shower blocks separate and within that shower block then you have everything um separate separated so yeah all good for driver comfort as best we can and um quick turnaround times as well 
cleansiness of the site is is high priority so therefore we won't have anybody messed about in the site if they're in dirty pigs that they might be well then three strikes and you're off this site there's no kissing your employer whoever's booked it will also get charged and fined for the state of the showers but nowadays most of the guys they keep the trucks right they keep themselves right and they come in here and use the facilities and then we were on-site cleaners keeping it of it but yeah good job good job <laughs>we're just back from Chester this morning with a client and gonna pop in to our Hollyhead transport hub. Very, very busy this weekend, very busy this week, so make sure the guys are doing all right. And two new clients to meet. I'll just meet them remotely actually, and then we'll meet them remotely, have a meeting with them, see what packages they want. It's all the packages, which include um, secure parking, overnight parking, safety inspections, all the usual. So let's see what's happened. Right, so as per usual, Mark's on site, um, managing his managers on site and the vehicles are always rinsed down before they go out. They're going down to lift trailers at port to bring the bike in for storage, swap drivers. I think one's going on down as far as Chester as well, actually where it was earlier, to drop the trailer off. So, long, long day, long week. Let's keep going. <laughs> What an absolutely beautiful day here in Hollyhead. We've been here all week. There's been snow, there's been sleet, there's been all the usual. Wonder where them boys are. And um, we second. Is that that far away? All the trackers see where the old man is. Oh, see him coming through the, the gap here now. So, Taylor's been lifted, sent over for safety inspection. And I think we have a job in the fridge, Thermal King. That there turned out a wee bit more awkward maybe than it should have. But just looking at today, the day there is 73 movements going on, um, which is good. So we've all comes in here through our own our own systems as well of what's going back from the site for you guys to book on. So a lot of people obviously watch the content for the transport compliance and operator license and all that jazz as well as the business side. So from the business side, it's definitely been a hell of a long week. It's Saturday, as I say, I'm having my way back down to Conway after this visit. And then we'll see, can we maybe take a couple of hours off Saturday night, possibly. And then we're back over on the boat on Sunday, client meeting Sunday morning, back on the boat, Irish ferries this time. Face this way if I can't see me. And um, yes, number of operating centre applications for this particular site. Um, we have hybrid offices. Um, actually, with some across the way here. That office out there is a hybrid office for transport operators. We have a number of issues with tachographs and driver's hours with particular companies that have vehicles not locked in with the company card because they're on remote downloading. So we have a number of issues with that bike with DV enforcement and we have two with DVSA enforcement here as well. So that is the plan at the minute. Right, it's time to get to the next meeting. guys so we're now back here at Hollyhead port and we're gonna jump back over across the pond this time we're going to use the irish ferries so they have a new boat a new vessel on and we usually always come stand line back in and out however we're going to try irish ferries on the way home today so the gear that the counter was telling us that um they have a new boat on which is also accommodating foot passengers instead of the freight vessel that they used to have on all before that so we'll probably get something on that down the line because obviously we work closely with these guys for getting in and out of hollyhead so traffic's about to move on anyway if you're the driver of the wee 
Scania R Series from for KMC Transport. I've tried to get your attention for a wee while because you've got a flat wheel actual one on your side and you're about to load the boat. You can't zoom into the flat wheel, but anyway, I tried my best to get your attention, but you're too busy eating. Right, let's go. Ready, so I don't know if you can see us or not, but that's back in Dublin. Just pulled in here for a bit of healthy eating, which as you can see is KFC or rice box. So we're not bad on a course watching some of the guys here on Backs and Breakers. So good YouTube channel. So we're gonna get something to eat down the road home, but two hours drive and then uh, we'll do it all again tomorrow. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for all your support. Please like, subscribe, comment, forward, do what you have to do. Just do something. Anyway, till next time.